In December, protests and public outcry flowed through India and then worldwide after a 23-year-old woman was gang raped in New Delhi by six men. She died a few weeks later. Thursday, India's parliament passed a new law to offer more protection to women against sexual violence. So what does that mean? The Wall Street Journal reports the law makes stalking and voyeurism crimes for the first time. Plus, it provides harsher punishment for rape and acid attacks, at least 10 years in prison for acid attacks, and requires hospitals to give rape victims medical treatment. Still, the law isn't perfect, the Los Angeles Times notes. The law doesn't address marital rape, rape committed by the armed forces, or rape against men. The law also sets the age for consensual sex at 18, which is still a point of contention. Conservatives feel this will maintain India's morality and discourage premarital sex. But some wanted the age at 16, worrying an older age of consent would encourage parents to make false accusations against boys to protect their daughter's honors. That even if a boy and girl had consensual sex, the boy would be accused of rape. The Global Post also points out the law doesn't address child trafficking and incest. And there are concerns it was rushed into place and untrained police won't know how to properly enforce it. But activists seem to agree that, bottom line, this new law is at least something. A step in the right direction in a country where violence against women is a serious cultural problem. Just last week, a Swiss tourist was gang raped in the nation. The new law will come into effect after President Pranab Mukherjee's approval. For Newsy, I'm Lauren Zima. Multiple sources, a broader view.